see. Come on, Twitch. Work. Work. You're live. I am? Yeah, my computer just told me so. Yes. There is a problem loading streams. That can't be good. Oh, I see the stream. Okay. Did it just change? No. It's still there. No, like, did I change from the opening screen to... Continue a new game? Yeah. Yes. Sweet. So we are live. And hopefully we are recording. Um, Hopefully, because I can't, because I can't figure out how to get Hypercam to work. Okay. Um. This will be our weird discussion about KH3 and Aqua and how she's going to have time with Flash. <laughs> yeah, so basically the story is going to start with, you know, they go to pick her up and she thinks they look familiar, but they don't tell her who the hell they are. All Sora really says is, you know, the guy who talks to me in my head says he knows you. And that's all I really know about him. He doesn't even give me his name. And she's like, you guys look very familiar. And then they just like, yep, well, come on, let's go. But before that, Ansem, is, Ansem forgets who she is and just wanders off down the beach, leaving her completely alone. <laughs> and so then they go and they show up at Yenzed's tower. And everybody's there and she's about asking all these questions. And they're like, there will be time for that later, Aqua. We have to go get Ventus. <laughs> so they go to get Ventus. And they get Ventus. Uh, and Sora's like, hey, that's the guy who talks in my head. And when she meets Kyrie, she recognizes the necklace. And she's like, where did you get that? And she's like, oh, I've had that since I was really little. How long was I gone? Look, well, there's no time for this. We have to keep going. We have to go kill We have to go kill Xehanort. Xehanort? He's back? And then she meets Ansem Seeker of Darkness. Ze uh, Zemnis and Terranor all at once, who are all members of the new organization. <laughs> oh my god, free Terras! It's like what I dreamed about when I was... Uh, never mind. <laughs> Terra, you're in their fight. Wait, who's Terra? That'll be like everybody else will be like, who the hell is Terra? Quick, Aqua, summon your Keyblade! Okay, wait, I don't have it. I don't anything. have it! Run away! So they run <laughs> back to Radiant Garden to find her Keyblade. And there she meets... Enzo, who tries to explain to her what happened. Because, you know, Sora's mentioned nobodies, but no one's ever told Aqua what a nobody is. So she's, like, utterly and completely confused about this, this <laughs> concept of what a nobody is. And then they go back to Yensen's tower. And it's like, um, uh, I'm trying to think. Aqua, you should really be wearing more sensible clothes. You're oh, yeah. over 30. Oh, yeah, you're almost 30 years old. <laughs> <laughs> you're almost 30 years old. You should be oh, wearing pro different proto clothes. Proto wants him. Proto wants him. We gotta, we gotta add, I'm gonna add him. Okay. I could have... What the fuck is with Frodo's image? I don't know. Frodo, answer the phone. You scary, scary little man. I'm uh, Atazama from Blaze Blue. We're not talking Birth by Sleep, we're talking the future shock Aqua's gonna be in when she shows up. Like, the fact that she's almost I heard 30. Aqua and I'm like, Birth by Sleep, I've been playing that recently, I can discuss this. <laughs> yeah, well, Aqua, you careful. should dress more sensibly, you're almost 30 years old. I'm not almost 30! Well, technically you are. Should and be then 30, she's in the but... corner rocking back and forth. <laughs> you should be 30, but the plot won't allow it. That's and, because she's been in the realm of darkness for over ten years. Yeah, and then she's like just talking to him about what happened, so they try to explain the plot to her. <laughs> and, you, then, and she just dies. Can you dumb it down? <laughs> this is the dumbed down version. An hour Do you want to hear the complex version? An hour later, she's just banging her head into the desk. <laughs> an hour after that, she's just sitting there catatonic, a little bit of drool comes out of the corner of her mouth. <laughs> and that's when we get to young Master Xehanort. She's like, what? He's an old man. He possessed Terra. Oh, no, there's a young version of him running around, too. You see, he went back in time and made himself evil. He... Because, what? you know, time travel. Why not? Sure. That is. <laughs> I'm just, like, so utterly confused. <laughs> and then she just, then she breaks the fourth wall and yells, I blame Nomura. 
no, no, it gets better. It gets better. <laughs> she right, like, you know, because Ven's back now too. Because Ven now, Ven has to under try to understand this shit too. They have to, no wait. He's seen it all from Sora, so he understands. He's like, Aqua, come on. This is like stuff you should know. We were supposed to be the smart one. You're you're the one to talk. You're inside this guy's heart for ten years. What? You're, the, yeah, you're supposed to be the one who's supposed to go, supposed to make light things on fire. Yeah. Why aren't you lighting things on fire? Yeah, Ven knows all this shit because he's had a front row seat to it. <laughs> mm, this movie is delicious. <laughs> he's, just there he's, he's eating vain popcorn. <laughs> and then they get to like who Riku and Kairi and Sora are and how old they are, and she's like, you, so, so "You're 17, but when I met you, you were six. No, I was five. <laughs> she's looking no, up and down. Four, no, no. Start yet, when they first meet, she starts flirting with Riku until he tells her, "You know, you met me when I was five. Okay." <laughs> 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 well, actually, if you, if you look closely in the game, it's, uh, Sora that acts a bit weirder around Aqua than, uh, Riku. Yeah, but Riku's also the more... Mature one? one. Yeah, he's built. Something he's he's also the one that gets all the fangirls. Fangirls! Oh, we already talked about what the fangirls want. The fangirls want uh, uh, Sora and Riku to get together, so I say, why not give him Xeon? It's Kairi <laughs> and Sora! <laughs> there are people who ship Ven and Aqua. It's believable. It it sort of works, but it's just plain weird because Aqua's what, 19 in the game? 17, 18, something like that, and Ven's supposed to be like 15 or 16. Yeah. Not, not that far out. Not that yeah, but it's Especially still- Especially by Japan standards, you know? In Japan, 13 is the age you consent, so yeah, that it wouldn't be so weird. True. Mm-hmm. That being said, we're, we, what else were we talking about earlier before we just decided to record this? Um, are we supposed to be playing Final Fantasy? Yes, we are, but we are using this as a, an excuse to, um, oh my god, set up, Final Fantasy, work! Set up a break screen, put it on break screen, and then record. I am recording, okay, break screen time. God damn it, my break screen's gone. Huh, I, I love that break screen of yours. It's like, black. I will have a break screen in a second. Let's see, we are talking... Oh yeah, we were talking about, um... A comic idea with, um... Damn it, before we got to the point where um, Aqua was banging her head against the wall, we were talking about another character having a comic um, around them. This will work. How's that, Proto? <laughs> Have you showed that to Smash yet? Yes! <laughs> I fear what would happen if Dark ever saw it. <laughs> His head would explode. <laughs> Better yet, I should erase Vegeta's head and make it sell. <laughs> it it would be it would be the fusion between Vegeta and Cell. And, oh, we were talking about Axel, and oh, yeah. he'd be the one fighting down Issa. Yeah, he's actually going now. Lee is actually going to take over as the main character and fight Sora's dinner, who's actually Xehanort. <laughs> no, no, no. He, that's, that's my plot. <laughs> he's gonna extend his promise, you know, now that he knows that, you know, the reason why Syax was such a fucking prick was because of a Xehanort parasite, that's what I'm calling the fragments of Xehanort's heart. It's like, you know, he beats him, he, like, rips out the little chunk of Xehanort's heart with his keyblade, and it's like, you know, I always bring my friends back. Which I do like that about Lee slash Axel. And then, um... What else had we talked about? Uh, we talked about how depressing Luxord's last words were. Oh, yes. Because he was the... Cl outside of Axel and Xeon, he was the closest to Roxas. And so that whole, how could you, Roxas, becomes really depressing when you think about it. Roxas was like his best friend. Outside of Xeon and Axel, of yeah. course. No, no. If, from Luxord's point of view. 
We never see him hang out with anybody except Roxas. I mean, in the manga, he plays cards with Axel and Zigbar, but... They play- he plays cards with everyone in the manga. Yeah, he, he's, he's got a freaking he's got a poker club. Um... Po -po 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 poker face, poker face. Thanks, Swanka. Let's see, what else? What else? What, what else? Oh! Oh! Um... Getting Terra back. That would be fun. And his future shock. The fact that he's aged, because, you know, Xehanort continued to age, and Terra's, you know, Terra's body continued to age, so he's like almost 30, he's 30 years old, Aqua's still 17, he goes, Well, there go my chances with you. <laughs> <laughs> because you know what, why not shipping? Oh, now I remember, now I remember, um, the armor. Oh, oh yes, the... yes, <laughs> Terra's Keyblade armor is in the Keyblade graveyard, and anytime someone stumbles in there, it gets up and kills them. <laughs> this in Ooh, the armor. Clunk. And then it steals their hearts and eats them, and that's how Terry he just... stayed alive all this time. His will has been sustained by the hearts of the innocent people that stumble into the Keyblade graveyard. And, and everyone he sees, because he cannot see, he, he just thinks it's Xehanort, so he murders them. Yeah, what you... just sets the tiny bit of darkness in their hearts, and it's like, Xehanort? Who's Xehanort? Xehanort! What you don't just... see is behind the boss fight, there's just a pile of skeletons. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, that's just the key, no, that's just the keyblades from, from the victims he murdered. <laughs> and all of them were just Kingdom K from the amount of time Sora died to him in Final Mix. <laughs> and, and at one point, this one guy comes up to him. What is this, a hollow suit of armor? He takes the helmet off. Xehanort. Oh my god, it's Alphonse Elric! <laughs> Xehanort! Xehanort! And he stabs the guy in the chest and he rips out their heart. <laughs> We're not he here! Himself off from. <laughs> like, a, like a guy to study Keyblades and how, and how they work. He goes there, he scrapes some rust off of the, one of the Keyblades to get a better look at it. And then he, he, then he sees something shiny over in the distance. He walks over to it, it appears to be a perfectly preserved piece of Keyblade armor. Suit of Keyblade armor and a Keyblade, and he's like, like, wow. Yeah. <laughs> then he hears Xehanort, and he's like, did that come from the armor? Is there somebody in it? And he takes the head off, and he sees nothing's in it, and then the helmet speaks again, Xehanort. Oh, uh, oh, oh, and Aqua's technology shock at gummy, gummy ships. What is that? Oh, it's a gummy ship. Oh, oh what? what is a gummy ship? Oh, you, they, 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 they're gummy ships. It's candy. Ships. And they run off happy faces, and they all make stupid faces, and she's like... Like this? No, no, she My doesn't even do that. Keyblade armor! What's Keyblade armor? My Keyblade glider! Because, random female from the, from the past, this it's is obsolete. the future! And she's like, just so confused, eventually she confronts Master Xehanort. My dear Aqua, I could tell you everything and explain it in a simplified manner. She turns her Keyblade on them. Fuck this! He <laughs> promises me answers. You guys have told me nothing. We have told you everything, Aqua. So, guys, this is this our predictions for KH three? No, this is just random bullshit. <laughs> just, I just hope the series will a, a continue of a logic could be applied to Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> no, this is just, this is just a logical conclusion of what Aqua will go through. And eventually, they get Ansem back, but he's still amnesic. Who are you? Who so, do we already mention? Uh, Aqua seeing Kyrie with uh, Destiny's Embrace. Hey, that's my Keyblade that I used before. I, used I got that. from a little How girl. How did you get that? <laughs> and th no, and then she pulls out her own Destiny's Embrace. She's just like, are you from the, are you the future? <laughs> uh, um, okay, who, what, what, what else? Um, Aqua running into somebody she knew that was her own age is now a middle-aged man with a family. You look like a girl I used to know. Are you by chance her daughter? No, it's it's like um, Scrooge. She, she runs into Scrooge McDuck again. Just this time, he's older. Hmm. Scrooge looks the I same. Th oh, I think I remember seeing you ten years ago, or was it eleven? Maybe twelve. You haven't at lay aged the day, lassie. You haven't aged the day, lassie. I always look the same because Disney makes me look the same. <laughs> And yet, oh no, Yen said, Yen said, he, like, during his lecture about how everything's working, and she keeps asking questions, he goes, I don't see how Eric has favored you so. You're quite annoying. 
<laughs> I used to be a Keyblade Master, but I doth oh wait, that was in the game. <laughs> no, and then Lee has a Keyblade, she goes, Do they just hand these to everybody nowadays? Do I have to work for And then this? Titus is like, Hey, I got a Keyblade! <laughs> you can't go out of nowhere with a Keyblade that looks like uh, Brotherhood from Final Fantasy X. Like and Lulu blue. and Irvin are there, flirt- Irving's flirting with Selfie and Waka's flirting with Lulu and they're all in school uniforms. And then it's like, like, and then they tell Aqua, yes Aqua, everyone gets a goddamn keyblade. Captain <laughs> Ash Zipper shows up and pulls one out. Maleficent getting the No, then, then apparently no more a combative number with his zipper, with his zipper keyblade. It's a keyblade made of zippers. <laughs> and sea salt ice cream. And belts. <laughs> And more ice cream. Because I have a belt fetish. Because belts. No, it's a keyblade that looks like young Sora. And then, and then at the very, very end, they make Roxas his own person again, and him and Ventus do the mime thing. <laughs> <laughs> the, only the only difference between um Ven and Roxas is that Ven is the keyblade armor thing on his shoulder. Yeah. No. No. Aqua just sits there. I give up. I legitimately <laughs> give up. What has what has happened within the, the ten years I was in this dark world? I mean, she didn't want to go back to the realm of darkness. Yeah, she just goes back to the realm of darkness after she sees Ben <laughs> and Rox just doing the can can together. She goes, "I'm going back to the dark oblivion from whence I came." I <laughs> don't. A portal and leave. Out. <laughs> she shows up. There's a dark side there. She goes. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> like, she's just completely broken. She's got tears coming down her face. She's just insane from all the cage bullshit. She sees the dark side. Honey, I'm home. And then it proceeds to kill her. No, they raise a family together of little shadows. <laughs> little half-muted thingies. Yes, they make a nice, comfortable home. Beach house. Considering that they do have a beach in the realm of the darkness. Yes, it's a beach it, house. She she takes up surfing on the flat, calm water. Never she, quite she gets just, the hang of it. She meets a nice dark side and marries it. I just said that. Oh, you did? Okay, I, I wanted to make sure I couldn't hear it. I wasn't listening. And they raise a bunch of little shadows and <laughs> an invisible is their neighbor and a dark ball's its wife and... Then, then that giant thing, the secret boss in Final Mix. Hunter of the Dark is their pet. She's chained pet. up to a little dog house out back. <laughs> <laughs> and she spends the rest of her miserable days just sitting there, weeping in horror at the stuff she had to endure in the actual plot. You're in the realm of dark, she is safe from all that. <laughs> She's safe from the horrible plot. She's By marrying the dark side and having children related to shadows, the invisible, the dark ball, and the giant whatever that thing is. Yes. Uh. And then Nominate comes in and says, because you're connected to Sora's heart, I can erase your memories. <laughs> <laughs> yes, please! <laughs> but she overdoes it and leaves her a vegetable. <laughs> <laughs> she forgets that she was actually a per person, so she decides to become a cucumber. No, but Tara, Tara, 30-year-old Tara goes, I will care for her. And so he takes her back with him, and they, like, visit him years later. Of course, he's living in seclusion because of the horror that he committed. And he's just, like, spoon-feeding her applesauce. <laughs> it's my punishment. I deserve this. Wait, wasn't she a cucumber? No. Uh, I would really like the more, um, he put, uh, he, he put the cucumber uh, aqua into a blender, not knowing it was aqua. No, she just tilts her head and says, Bullshit! That's all she can say. <laughs> Bullshit. That's all that's the only bring up the, no, the next the next saga, after the Seeker of Darkness saga, they come to recruit Terra, and they she sees them and just starts screaming because, you know, nobody can only hide the memories. Eventually they're just gonna resurface. So what about Vanitas? <laughs> oh, he'll be she's back dead. too. Oh, he's no, he'll, he's renting he's, a nice space out he's renting a nice penthouse in Sora's heart. Yeah, he is. <laughs> <laughs> and if he's one of the Xehanort clones, that means Xehanort's in Sora's heart, too. Which means literally everyone is in Sora's heart, even the bad guys. Sora <laughs> should start running a hotel service. <laughs> okay, oh, so when I hear to collect rent, Ah, oh, Sora, it's good to see you t today. Here, here's one million monies. 
<laughs> Melanies. <laughs> you know. It, Thanks, Ian. Or, man, why are you my nicest tenant here? Because oh, I'm you're a nice a old man. Enough, but I am a nice old man. Who now gets to live forever since I'm inside your heart. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> the final battle takes place in Kingdom Hearts, and Sora wins, and he wishes everything to go back to the way it should be. So all the worlds unite into one. And all the Final Fantasy characters who have been separated... The and then show, randomly to meet each other, and the first thing Cipher and Leon do are trying to kill each other. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, there was a really stupid plot twist in Final <laughs> Fantasy VIII revolving around memory loss. Beca yeah, because of the, the Guardians. Yeah, the Guardian Force. All our characters were somehow friends, but they, they, were, they were friends because they used overpowered summons. Yep. And then Titus meets up with the little Yuna fairy, and he goes, This is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> and then Peter and, Pan and gives she... him lessons, and he become, he kills Peter Pan, and becomes the new Peter Pan, and she becomes the new Tinkerbell. <laughs> <laughs> but, but, but what about um, Riku and Pain? Fuck them! <laughs> <laughs> well, well, we don't need Pain, but we do need Riku for the plot of ten. We don't need her for the plot of ten! She was a plot of ten. Ten actually has a new ending in HD. You know what? You know. Okay, here's what they do. In they HD, get... Riku dies. No, you know what they do? They give Riku in pain to Maleficent. You want to ha you want to claim to be a fairy? You get to hang out with fairies. Here, take them from us. We don't need them anymore. And then she spends the rest of her days being annoyed by Riku's constant talking. <laughs> <laughs> But wait, Riku isn't, isn't with Maleficent anymore. It doesn't matter. She's a fairy. They're fairies. They belong together. That's, he that, secretly that, caught that her, be, and, and, and all he wanted in his life was to prove that fairies exist. Uh, the nope. original Xbox was originally going to be called um, either Max, Face, Myth, Mega, CPG, V-E-R-V, O-M, and A-O-A. I O. And then we have um, I'm I'm just trying to pick up more random Kingdom Hearts bullshit I can pull out of my ass here. Um, oh. Dragon Conroy comes and saves the world. No, <laughs> Ben and Rock just spend the rest of their days doing twin switches. Can't get retained of memories in the UK. KH problems. You know what a real KH problem is? The okay, amount of consoles you need to play the fucking series. Let's That's see. so true. Yeah. Let's is, see. Is that on there yet? No, it's not. Yeah. Right now, there's, um, Spar Gaston is one of them. Spar needs to add that. The amount of fucking consoles you need to understand the fucking plot. Let's yeah, see. We need the best games to get the best keep. PS2, GBA. Well, you don't need the GBA anymore. Unless you're if you live in Europe. GBA! <laughs> we don't need the GBA anymore. GBA anyway! <laughs> a DS, GBA. A PSP, a 3DS. No, um, and you know what's I funny? said that. PSP, I PS2, PS2 GBA, um, DS, and 3DS. That's five different consoles PS4. now. And now you need a PlayStation 4, and if people didn't have a DS or a GBA, they need a PlayStation 3 now as well. Because that's... Well, no, no, no. Because Coded. Coded's not going to be part of the HD1 remix. So you still need a DS for that. Yep. Yeah, that's seven different consoles you need to buy to enjoy the... Co to understand... The even hold the on! The seven KH consoles. <laughs> there's one for each fucking game at this point. <laughs> and no. Let's see, no, but there's a bunch of games. There's... Two on P no three on PS2, one on GBA, two on DS, and one on 3DS. But there's about and one on PSP. Yeah, and one on PSP. That's about at least ten KH games. That's four. That's that's eight. Not counting Final Mix re-releases <laughs> and the HD One Remix, which is on. Oh, PS3. don't forget! Oh, don't forget! There's there's one on Verizon's mobile service. Yes, the original Coded. No, oh, wait, no, 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 that's no, Japan. No, that stupid, like, mix and match thing, right? KH Coded? KH Mobile? No, uh, VCast. Yeah. Proto, that was another, like, mobile phone. Proto, that, you're, uh, Proto, you're kind of like, can you go into your Skype settings and change?
Turn down your audio. Yeah, it's sure. Always loud. Shut up. Is that well, better? For a potato, no. it's extremely um, noisy. I'm kind of not, not allowed. Um, you go to your main thing, you click tools, you go to options. Oh, fuck. And then you see your right sounds. Uh, no, audio settings, and you see the microphone thingy. Better? Yeah, turn that down quite a bit. Is it better? It's getting better. Is it better? Sure. Yeah. What? Yeah, better. I can't hear any of you now. You're turning down the wrong thing then. You turned down the and I'm back from turning off every God damn it. You turned down the speaker most likely. You need to turn down the microphone. I can't turn down the microphone. Automatically adjust microphone settings. That should be a box right there. Unclick it. I have no idea who the fuck keeps turning all my lights on, but it's starting to piss me off. Okay, it's automatically adjusted. Am I good? Yeah, you're better now. Good. <sighs> oh, and now so the kiss comes back. <laughs> and he's like, he's and just he's like, oh, okay, you know what? I I'm dead, but because plot, I'm not dead anymore. No, no, no he spent. He, that's the only thing that's kept Terra alive all these years. Hey it's, guys, I fully Terra understand Kingdom Hearts. Things. It's like the, It's like this. Hey guys, me and Terra fully understand Kingdom Hearts. No, I'm no. alive because I kind of understand that now. No, they bring him back and the first thing he does is pick up where he left off. Scream in rage and try to murder Ventus. <laughs> it's like, mm -mm, um, oh yeah, raw! And no, it, no, the first thing they do, first thing he and Terra do when they are restored is like, hey guys, we fully understand the plot of Kingdom Hearts. Why is that? Because we are inside Terra's head. Not Terra's head, Xehanort's head. Yes. We so technically it was my game. head. So technically it was Terra's head because Xehanort was It was Xehanort my head that Xehanort was in. Let's not delve too deeply into that. <laughs> um, let's see, what else? What else could we make fun of? Um... Ya boy, Bill Knife. Oh, the fact up. that, um, Marluxia and Larkseen are sitting in the Dark World waiting for their Heartless to show up. <laughs> no. They're already back. They're part of the new organization. I'll I, I'm calling it now. They didn't, they didn't. They didn't want their hearts back. All the guys who were part of the old organization, who we haven't seen pop up yet, are going to be part of the new one. Because it's just how the numbers are going to fill out. Yeah, there's a bunch of different Xehanorts that we didn't haven't seen yet. It'd be easier to recycle old models that somewhat already exist and make entirely new ones. Um, let me see. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm reading this Twitter. Scientifically, if your heart was broken, you'd be dead, so shut up, hoes. <laughs> well, it's, uh, the Ya Boy Bill Nye account. Okay. You should go follow that. No. Cool. All enough crap as it is. Same here, but still. You want to see... Let's see how many people I follow on Twitter. I follow 123. I follow 84, okay? And that's enough. I can never, like, read everything. I How the hell do I have 12 followers? I have 46. Okay, Quotable Swaka, Kibori, Bio, Speed, Will, Geo, Max, Kirby, Skell, You, Proto, uh, Morgan, and some weird-ass dude. <laughs> I'm followed by Base... And treble and forte, which is bass. So he's got followed by bass twice. Yay! Yay, bass. I'm also followed by Digi and Chaffex Grenade. Speaking of Digi, he just popped up being retweeted by uh, Enton. Yep. Thanks to everyone who stopped by to watch me. Play. Oh, I'm also followed by uh, Mega Man, Roll, Doctor Light. <laughs> You're I'm a potato. By Mega Man forever. You're a potato, the prototype of a potato. Let's see, I'm followed by Super Cozy, um, Skelzor, Spar, Dark, Proto, Soul, uh, Geo, um, Kim Al Ra, don't know who that is, <laughs> Kirby, Video Game Problems, um, Eberhan, 
Max, Utai, Chavi, Sanic, Zangor, Swaka, um, Gibby, Quotable Swaka, Dragon Hunter V, Roni, Mon Monochrome, Violet, and Jesse Purz. By the way, Proto, did you get my warning? What? About a certain Twitter account that was following yours? Yeah, I know. I don't follow it. But I'm tempted to. I was tempted to make a false Twitter account and mess with it. <laughs> but that's how it stalks us. It's following us. Slaughtered all my friends. Okay. Slaughtered all my friends. <laughs> Thank you, Matt. Is that Matt? Yes, it is Matt. Oh, hey, you're kind of quiet. Hold on. Matthew, be quiet. <laughs> Bring out the stuff. Bring out the stuff. And random appearance by Matt. Or Doom Soul. Hi there. So, um, yeah, how about that break screen? <laughs> I love it. I got uh, I I got the idea from uh, Two Saints Napa. play. Na uh, Takahata101 who plays Napa said, "I want someone to do a picture of you." <laughs> Appa apparently, all the Mega Man, all, like the classic Mega Man characters that follow me, are um they think I'm a novelty account apparently. But you are. I'm not. I'm just proto. I'm just proto. You're Proto Man X. You're the ex Proto Man. You're what I'm gonna Proto follow Man all these Mega Man be. accounts. I'm just gonna follow all these because Mega Man. So anyway, <laughs> with yeah, the, the, the account I, I named for Doctor Light is Doctor Light or Right. I'm also followed by uh, Lendaru. Doctor Light or Right, if you are from Japan, also known as Rockman. The, oh, um, Violet, Chabby, Morgan, uh, Dakai Bleach, Max, I love Japanese games, Geo, Roni, this guy, John, who likes RPGs and stuff, Sanic, Smish, Kirby, Skell, Utai, Klonoa, Souls, Dark, a bunch of other people, D -d 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 -boom. uh, Barrel Dragon, Monochrome, Armac, Kurobo Swaka, Shattuck, Pixelated HD, I don't know what that is. Uh, Ryder. Okay. Followed by a lot of people. Yeah. It turned, okay, you know what, back to the weird Kingdom Hearts talk, because I had another interesting idea. What if Xehanort's the good sure. guy? I'm just trying to save the world. No, what if he's legitimately the good guy? You all. Of course, there's another random, like, chat... <laughs> ...call thing. Of course. And it's just like, Emerald's just like, up, oh, call, why not? The, um... Yeah, I'm kind of running out of weird shit to say about Kingdom Hearts. Why am I actually play some freaking Final Fantasy? What is this? What is this? Let's go look at Swaka. What's going on at Swaka? Uh, thing Angel linked. Okay, if I can Oh, look! I can choose his name now. You are one. One? So I'm gonna be two? No. You are E. Isn't it weird how our names contain less than seven letters? They're all named AAA, except for the main guy who is named E. E? E, 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 E. Because, you know what? Screw it. Are you a black man? Are you a warrior? Um, yeah, I took the basic party. Yeah, me too. Emmer dudes, why? <laughs> what do you do? 
it's not in the regular squawk of chat, so I can't say. So chat is it in? Proto. Proto. What? What? What, what emeralds? Emeralds what? Emer dudes. Yeah, Emer dudes what? What did he Start do? Start a call in the uh, Cards Against Humanity chat. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, Emer dudes why? You know what? I'm tempted, to, I'm tempted to go join that call. You know, you could do that because I'm kind of done. I don't really want to play this. I just wanted to get that weird Kingdom Hearts fucking talk we had going up recorded. I only chose Final Fantasy because it was made by the, you know, basic, same company. Yeah, same company. But I think okay, I'm let's end it. Let's go now. I have things I want to watch and listen to. Yeah. Okay, guys. Later. See ya.